Welcome back into my another lecture. Dear friends, we are discussing the model question paper for the mathematics subject uh, for CSC stream students. Okay, so it is the similar problem what we have done earlier in the previous lecture. Okay, the joint uh, probability distribution of uh, random variables x and y are as follows. This is the joint distribution table. Okay, so you have to determine marginal distribution of x and y, expectation of x, expectation of y, and expectation of x y, covariance of x y and correlation of x y okay these are the terms which we have to determine so <clears throat> i will just proceed with the same steps what we were doing earlier okay first make the box as it is okay this much box as it is then you have to do the summation of the uh, terms these uh, probabilities uh, row wise okay 1 plus 1 by 8 plus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 8 is equal to 1 by 2 1 by 4 plus 1 by 8 1 by 8 is equal to 1 by 2 again okay then column wise you have to do addition 1 1 by 8 plus 1 by 4 is 3 by 8 Similarly, this one is 3 by 8. Similarly, this, this one is 1 by 4. Okay. So, sum of probabilities should be always equal to 1. Okay. So, 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2 is 1. 3 by 8 plus 3 by 8, 1 by 4 is equal to 1. Okay. So, this table is correct. Now, we have to draw the marginal distribution table. <clears throat> How we are taking this? So, x values you have to take first 1 and 5, 1 and 5. Corresponding f of xi value 1 by 2, 1 by 2. Summation of terms. Okay. So, 1 by 2, 1 by 2. So then y, y terms are here, minus 4, minus, sorry, 2, 7, minus 4, 2, 7, corresponding g of y i value, 3 by 8, 3 by 8, 1 by 4, okay. So 3 by 8, 3 by 8, 1 by 4, okay. This is the marginal distribution table. Then we are supposed to calculate the expectation of x, expectation of y. So expectation of x is equal to summation of x i into f of x i, means product of x i and f of x i. See here, x i is here, f of x i is here. So uh, you have to take multiplication of this then summation so 1 into 1 by 2 plus 5 into 1 by 2 so 1 into 1 by 2 plus 5 into 1 by 2 this uh, likewise you have to take it okay so when you calculate it you will get expectation of x is equal to 3 then expectation of y it is similarly the product of these y and g of y i minus 4 into 3 by 8 minus 4 into 3 by 8 2 into 3 by 8 2 into 3 by 8 okay uh, then 7 into 1 by 4 7 into 1 by 4 i hope uh, you are getting then you will get uh, the expectation of y as 1 over here then expectation of uh, x into y we have to calculate so there is a procedure how we are calculating this one sorry 1 into minus 4 into 1 by 8 this like this you have to calculate 1 into minus 4 into 1 by 8 okay see here 1 into minus 4 into 1 by 8 then 1 into 2 into 1 by 4 1 into 2 into 1 by 4 then 1 into 7 into 1 by 8 1 into 7 into 1 by 8 then this one 5 into minus 4 into 1 by 4 5 into minus 4 into 1 by 4 5 into 2 into 1 by 8 5 into 2 into 1 by 8 5 into 7 into 1 by 8 5 into 7 into 1 by 8 you will get the, the calculation when you do the calculation in the calci you will get 1.5 as expectation of x y okay then we are supposed to calculate the covariance covariance you know the already the formula uh, expectation of x y minus expectation of x into expectation of y so expectation of x y is 1.5 or 3 by 2 simply 3 by 2 minus expectation of x how much we have calculated 3 and expectation of y is 1 so 3 into 1 3 by 2 minus 3 into 1 is minus 3 by 2 as covariance so in order to calculate the correlation there are two parameters which are uh, uh, which are necessary to calculate then only we can calculate the correlation okay sigma x square sigma y square so sigma x square is uh, the formula is expectation of x square minus expectation of x whole square so you no need to worry about the formulas uh, you will be given with the handbook over there okay so expectation of x square is nothing but it is simply summation of x i square f of x i okay in this it is a x square so it was simply expectation of x so you have to take summation of x i square f of x i that is what i have written over here uh, summation of x i square into f of x i minus expectation of x whole square okay so x i square means one square one square into one by two plus five square into one by two five square into one by two minus expectation of x already we have calculated three so minus three square okay so sigma x square is equal to four which is equal to under root of four sigma x is equal to two okay then sigma uh, y similarly sigma y square is equal to this one uh, summation of y i square g y gyi so y i square you have to take minus 4 square minus 4 square into 3 by 8 plus 2 square into 3 by 8 sorry this is here 2 2 square into 3 by 8 plus this is your 7 square into 1 by 4 7 square into 1 by 4 minus 1 square okay 1 is the expectation of y we have calculated it uh, over here expectation of y is 1 
okay so you will get sigma y square is equal to 75 by 4 which is equal to by shifting the square on the right hand side you will get the root of 75 by 4 okay so sigma y is equal to 4.33 by getting these two parameters here sigma x and sigma y then the formula for the correlation so correlation of x comma y is equal to covariance of x comma y divided by sigma x sigma y so covariance we have calculated so it is minus minus 3 by 2 okay so minus 3 by 2 divided by sigma x sigma x is 2 sigma y is 4.33 uh, when you just calculate it you will get the value 0 0.1732 okay so this much is the answer for this particular question i hope this much is clear to you people so make sure you will share this video to all your friends thank you